for this exhibition, he particularly wanted to focus on the social and political situation in the UK at the moment. So he's intentionally blocked out the, the view out to the North Sea, this sort of outward looking view with this enormous black canvas to basically represent the darkness of this contemporary moment in the UK and globally. Um, these figures that I'm surrounded by are, are workers. They're a kind of global, mobile workforce, um, which have actually traveled to the gallery on the train um, on Tuesday, which was quite a surreal sight for anyone else on the train. Um, and I guess he's interested in you know, the, the position of, of, of a worker in any country, across any border, um, almost trapped within the system of capitalism. I mean, I think the whole piece is very political. I think it's, it's, it's a broader idea of blocking the view and the outward looking view to anywhere really, and that gesture of blocking the light. But I guess there is still this sort of glimmer of hope that there, there is a slash in the canvas and you, you can just see the sea on the horizon. In this book, she um, drew on uh, notable women from the past, present, and future to construct a city that, I guess, defended women at a time when they were attacked quite constantly. Um, so she's used this simple format to construct her own city made up of uh, women, or at least women in a very expanded sense, uh, women, things that uh, exhibit ideas of the feminine. Um, and really it's to challenge all of the preconceptions or the ideas we have about the construction of society around patriarchal values um, and that, that same history. Nowadays it's um, it's not so much controversy, but that it's the artists are very much outspoken and um, speak about injustices or inequalities in the world and things they think need to be addressed. So I think that's the sort of the story in the prize this year. These artists are making strong political statements. They have something, I think, quite urgent and important to say about the world, but it's not kind of controversial for the sake of shock. Is actually there's a lot of depth in the work in this show. There's also a lot of variety. We're surrounded by sculpture and painting. In other galleries, there's video installation, um, print, um, installation, film, 
performance is also a big part of this year's show so a lot of the artists will be doing performances in some form or other um, so it's very diverse but also very political and I think there's a lot of content to get you to get involved with I think we see four incredibly strong exhibitions. Um, there is lots of practice going on right across the UK and globally. But I think you know, what we see here at, for Turner Prize 29 gives some indication of what's happening in contemporary practice.